Hello everybody, I'm Unboxing Bud Ryan, and I'm joined again by Unboxing Bud Shane. Hello guys. And today we have the, it's supposed to be the prepper box, but, uh, oh, I forgot to black out my information there. It's the prepper gear box, but Alpha Outpost, uh, I guess bought them out. Uh, I actually don't have really a whole lot of information on that, but basically if you guys want to Feel that. So, huh? So it's actually a it's a pretty cool box, that's for sure. Let's see if they kept the traditional items or if they started changing up a little bit for their yeah. Company. It's uh, is this thing upside down? No feeling it. <laughs> yeah, it's upside down. All right, so let's uh let's put we this knife that. down here and let's. To say, let no man say, had I only had the tools and the training. All right, so first off, let's see. This is the Alpha Outpost, uh, the Predator Box 12. Uh, I'm just gonna go. So, let me actually open this up. This looks kind of like it's a, uh, a little comic strip there. Showing you how to make a, a snare. Yeah, well, uh, I'll. Kind of show you guys all of this. You guys can pause the screen if you would like to see everything. But a little bit of hunting tips. Spear hunting history. So, actually, not a spear hunt too. Spear hunting is really yeah. cool. Um, so let's see. Warning: risk of crushing or cutting injury. Traps and snares have pinch points. Huh. All right. So if you guys want to read that, you can go ahead. I'm gonna have that. to take this box away from Ryan now before he hurts himself. Yeah, I don't wanna myself too much there so snare instructions for those of you guys who want to just take this and screenshot it for later it's actually uh pretty good information too all right so first off let's ooh it looks like we started off with a knife here that's what it looks like I'm assuming so so let's actually uh let's use a knife so that we can get our knife <laughs> Okay. So it's by Tactical Force. So let me just... Tact uh, tactical Rescue Outfit. So... So, big knife. Oh, what the... So that's... that's a pretty cool knife. I like that. So do I. So, it's a, it's a really good knife. So it has the normal... Locking system. Yay, we got a good knife. All right, so next up is your patch. Predator patch. Uh, Velcro patch. Yeah, it comes with the uh, Velcro tab that you can yeah, like so iron on. onto your or so on. Uh, <clears throat> lots of tender. Um, uh, oh yeah, this is the good stuff right here. Snare wire. And tender wire. And tender. <laughs> mixed into one. Let me... This is some heavy cable, too. This is some good stuff. So I'd used... Uh, I did survival training, and we used 550 cord. So this stuff would have been a lot better. So that's actually really cool. I like that. there's not some sort of thing that tells us what's in here. Was it in that pamphlet, maybe? Uh, not the pamphlet, but the big book. The big book. I guess where I heard hey, some sort of. You can of go ahead and look at that. So, let me just put this over here and think, yeah, this pull out all this kindling. The karambit knife. So, um, was that three snare wires? Yeah. So the karambit knife was valued at twenty dollars, and the snare wires were valued at three dollars a piece, mm -hmm. but nine in total. So let me just throw all this crap over here. That little booklet, the detailed guide on traps and snares was five dollars. And the patch was three dollars. Hey. Oh look at that. We got it. Oh man. Pretty sure I'm gonna hurt myself. <laughs> so the body grip trap? Yeah. That is fourteen dollars. Nice little trap. I'd set it, but I'm really scared I'm going to hurt myself right now in this little, because I'm kind of like 
my arms are kind of outreached in front of me there, so it's a little harder to grab stuff. So, all right, I think that's everything, correct? Yeah. So, there's the bottom of our box. I actually kind of really like this box. I wasn't, as soon as I saw the, the Alpha Outpost, I was kind of like, I don't know if I want to keep this. But, Oh, you hurt oh man, it almost snapped on my finger. That's why I said I'm going to back so, up before you hurt something. All right, so basically, I'm just going to leave the snap where it is. Because uh, the last thing I need is broken digits there. So, but anyways, this is, a uh, this is a trap. I got so much tinder in that corner. So, the body grip trap, which is $14. So, total value of, what takes this? Sog Spirit. I don't know. They crossed it out. So fifty two. So your total value would be fifty one dollars for all this. Yeah. So it actually has the list of everything that was in here, but they crossed out the Sog Spirit. I'm assuming this uh, was probably coming from their box. They probably bought this one because their box is the more expensive box originally, which is why I didn't buy them. You can actually see all the tinder over there. That's just with the knife underneath it. Yeah, you see my, yeah <laughs> this probably wasn't smart on my part. So, all right, that's my Gerber, as you guys have already seen. I very much love my Gerber, although... This new cramp is pretty cool. Yeah, it's, it's a really cool knife. I like the colors. So what was your favorite item? Uh, the bear trap. No, I'm just kidding, it's not bear trap. Bear traps scare the crap out of me, because I am accident prone. This is like for small game. My favorite part was definitely the night. Yeah, I I really love knives. The knives are my one of my favorite items. So I'm always excited when I get a knife. How sharp is this thing? It doesn't. So just mediocrely sharp, you know. <laughs> it's just a two fingers in there. So. Doesn't I mean, it feels like it has an okay edge compared to the skinny knife I got? It's not. Yeah, you can feel that. Uh, but in general, I love knives, so pretty much the knife's almost almost always gonna win. Uh, I do love these snare traps. I love those. Let's see how long these suckers are, real quick, while we're here. Uh, uh, I just want one of you. I just want one of you. So basically, for those of you who don't know, this is your hookup wire for your actual trap itself. You can hook it to a pinch, and then you got your actual snare, which you want to slide open a little bit more, so the game comes in and drops. I like the drop snares; those are my favorite. Basically, uh, you have a piece coming down from a tree, and then you have a piece in the ground, and the connect. Well, it's you know gonna be smaller, but big picture and when the rabbit or whatever you got catches this right here is going to be tied to this piece so wrong piece <laughs> it's going to be tied to this piece right here I'm upside down I'm looking at the camera so when the rabbit catches this piece snaps up and whatever's in here tightens pulls up into the air so you got it hanging from a tree Although, if you don't know what you're doing, it can be kind of a pain. I'm not the greatest at explaining stuff. Uh, although, I am the greatest at breaking stuff. That's why I took the expensive thing away from you. <laughs> anyways, I'm just, I should go like that. That's not maximum plus. So, anyways, uh, I, definitely like the, I definitely like the knife. I think that's kind of the round item here. Uh, I think it's also the most expensive item. Yeah, it was at twenty dollars. I'm pretty sure that Sog Spear is the uh, the spear shaped one. Yeah, probably. I'm like, missing. well, no, that's an actual spearhead. Yeah. The only reason I'm, I've never actually looked at Sog knives. Uh, I bought a Sog, but it had the button, button release. It had the button on the side here to unlock it. Unlock it. it. Didn't have the actual catch here, and I didn't. 
I really didn't like that because I'm always afraid that when I'm trying to cut something that the knife's going to break on me and cut my fingers off. <clears throat> I've had that happen. <laughs> Not cut my fingers off, but cut my hand. I cut my knuckles across the top here uh, from a crap knife that I had bought. But, so I don't know what the SOG Spirit is, but due to the fact that this whole thing is about spear hunting, I'm pretty sure the SOG Spirit is a spear. But who am I to know? Anyways, uh, I feel like the predator patch. I'm assuming it's this kind of thing. Oh yeah, it is a. I don't it's know. a small spear. I mean, it's probably about this long for the handle, and then about this long for the actual blade. Ten and a half inches. Oh, that works. Yeah, it's a double-edged spear head knife that you can tie onto. It was just not relevant since it's not in this box. Yeah. Anyways, uh, I don't know what the next box is going to be. It'll be for uh, December, December right? so and I don't know who's going to send out first. Usually, I would put it on Karen, getting here in time. Karen and Battle Box seem to be pretty fast at shipping, and, and sure uh, Treat Box as well. I'll make sure to be here for that Treat Box one. Oh, yeah, I wouldn't <laughs> doubt it. Uh so I can't give you a for sure. Uh, once they get here, I can kind of you know tell you what's gonna be when. Start mapping it out for yeah, you. Yeah, once they actually ship it, because I get the codes, I can look it up and I can tell you which one's gonna be here by then. Anyways, that's not important. Uh, if you like this video, go ahead and click the like button if you like. If not, well, hopefully you guys keep coming back. That's all I really care about. I could have zero subscribers as long as I got a lot of people coming to watch and enjoying this video and knowing I'm actually doing something that people like to see. Uh, but if you subscribe to us, that way our next video will pop straight up in your uh, feed there. Mm -hmm. Other than that, I don't know if Shane has anything he wants to say to you guys. Just going to say it's a lot nicer when uh, Josiah's not here. I get all the cool stuff before he does. <laughs> you also get a closer seat to the table there. Yeah. <laughs> Anyways, uh, from all of us here at Unboxing Buds, have a good one. See you guys later.